And hello everyone, Greg Scott Bailey here. Welcome back to my YouTube channel and welcome to day two of what I'm now calling the Grind to Alpha 21. Uh, we're of course on Alpha 20.6 B9 and that uh, sounds like a bingo thing. <laughs> and I'm just going through and getting some of the stuff up top here. Uh, like I said before, there's probably hidden trash or something like that that we could check, but I'm not going to worry about it. Uh, we do have to turn in this quest soon. It's almost six o'clock. I try to try to sort some of the uh, items that I got, or at least separate them. We can come back for more of this stuff later. I made a campfire and we boiled some water last night. Actually, speaking of which. Uh, let's go ahead and start the day with this stew. We're going to make sure that we're well fed. Uh, chances are we're going to find some more eggs. We'll make bacon and eggs later. Uh, day two, so you should be able to make a forge. And then you can make a pot and grill if you don't find one. So let's head back to the trader. Hey there, buddy. Oh, that is a big dog. All right, so we just leveled up. Uh, we got one point to spend. I put a point into uh, pack meal, uh, as promised. Uh, I said I was going to put that point into pack meal yesterday, so I did that before we officially started yeah, stream. Uh, till, before we officially started the uh, recording here. Now, how many? Uh, I don't want to use bullets on them if I don't have to. It's something I've been doing with Icarus is like save your ammo for critical situations. Like a bear. <laughs> Doesn't matter what game you're in. Bears hurt. Big old paws. All right. Well, this is going to be an interesting morning meal. There we go. Okay, can we do this without breaking our leg? Yep. We got, what, eight arrows back? Probably took about 10 or 12 to get them. It's a big fella. Ooh, howdy, that took forever. Okay, so we leveled up, right? Let's press the right buttons, Greg. And let's go ahead and do Skull Crusher 2. Oh, we can't. Not until Strength 3. Oh, gosh darn. Let's just put that into Strength 3 then. <laughs> okay. Off to the trader, officially. Of course, I just had to stop. Check a car. It's just, it's impulse. I have to. Just, I just got it. <laughs> you can't check just the car. You gotta check the trash around it. The, uh... Mailbox. Oh, okay. Ranger's Guide to Archery. Craft Exploding Arrows and Crossbow Bolts. Um, another suggestion somebody made was that I go back and do my Bows and Blades uh, challenge. And, you know, I I, I can't deny them. I'm, I'm kind of... I, I was thinking a little bit of that, that maybe I could do that one. Uh, for those that haven't seen it, uh, it is the first and only completed series that I've done for Seven Days to Die, and it's done Alpha... 19 and basically the challenge was well, i could only use bows blades and bombs and you know just watching the uh the choice of words when you're doing things online uh i didn't want to type bombs in the title so <laughs> uh so we called it bows and blades and it was a pretty fun series and then once you get up to explosive arrows and fire arrows they, it just really started getting a lot of fun congratulations I can make my payment to the uh, I think the bipod's going to be more critical than the uh, <laughs> the anything else. Again, we need 6,000 dukes for the workbench. I don't know if we're going to get that in time. Is there anything critical, though? I would say critical, but let's buy these eggs just, just for food anyways. Um, She does have concrete mix, too. Damn. And some foods. I don't know. Nothing really like oh, a lever action, a level two one, but 5,700 Dukes. I, you know, I never used the lever action rifle until recently. Uh, I mean, within the last two or three months. Uh, I, I think that's a goal. 5,760 Dukes. For the business. Stay safe out there. 
Let's see if we can't uh, do that. Let's do a quick buried supplies. Be careful. And, and come back and we'll get another mission. I actually decided uh, we're going to go take a look at this building here and see if it's viable for turning into a base. I don't know if I've been through this building before. Okay, looks like basic warehouse. Could probably set up something up top and then modify it from there. But where? Oh, where? Are oh, the zombies? Aha! There they are. Um, okay, that missed. That one didn't. But that other one did. Why are you going upstairs? Oh, come on. What? Oh, shoot. Misfired. I promise it never happens like that before. <laughs> some of these back. It's gonna be nice once we get some iron arrows. Okay, so there's a backyard. How defendable will this be? Not too bad, I think. Oh, there's our one of our arrows. Yeah, let's just keep taking a look here. Oh, somebody in the closet here. Oh, hello, lady. Glancing blow and kneecap. She fell head over heels for me. I don't blame her. <laughs> uh okay, so I mean yeah, I could I could build my own platform up top there. Um, I totally meant to fall down. Totally. Let's go and check and see what's in all these boxes. Paint and dye. I should say paintbrush and paint. Another hammer. All right. Well, at the very least, if we don't get enough repair kits, we know that we have a second hammer to fall back to. Hey, there's our first wrench, also level two. So, I, I mean, maybe a little bit does ring true. Oops, we woke up somebody. Maybe some of that does ring true that... Um, that first day or two, you do get level two items. I just always would have thought level one, right? Start start with level one and then go to level two. I'm not complaining. I'll take the level two or some more frames. Yeah. You know. Hey, ammo pile. Pop a pills up over here. Yeah. Gonna say, is this a room with a zombie? It's a room with some toilet water. Oh, but I don't have room for it. Uh, let's yeah, scrap that. Oh, uh, what else can we scrap? There we go. All right, some more medical bandages. I will not turn my nose up at that. Uh, let's get rid of some things. Go ahead and get rid of the dye. We don't need that. Uh, was there anything up top here? Nothing else I could see here. So, I wait. Oh, there's no window. I thought there was a doorway out over here. I don't know. We could, we could totally just multi-purpose or multi-use this. I mean, there's a torch there we could use now, or leave it there. It's gonna give us light already. Um, oh, is those are the doors that if you push the button, they'll open. Not active, not active. Oh, but there's a cupboard here. Ooh, all right. Empty can. <laughs> uh, I, I think we could totally like renovate this whole, whole thing, you know, try to clear up some of this. We'll, fill in that hole that was uh that's right here uh but for now let's let's start putting some stuff away here let's get the wrench on us and we're not not gonna really really be able to use that that rifle right now effectively i think so we're gonna put that away oh but we are gonna use that 
uh, let's put that in here. That's eight, hey, three more damage than it would have done. So I'll take it. Uh, but yeah, so we'll we'll renovate and we'll see if we can plug up some of this here. And if we can, if we have any zombie action, let's hope that they come around front. We, we could do some modifications too, where we try to put our own fencing around the uh, the property here. Uh, all right, let's go ahead and go do this uh, buried supplies quest. Oh, after place bedroll. Mostly to just claim the spot. If we're doing permadeath, that's uh, it's kind of pointless. But oh god, I just lobbed that. Wow. Okay, that one worked. <laughs> that one didn't. Ah, ding. <laughs> Got that arrow back. Let's get this one. Maybe. There we go. Man. I, I really, the sooner we can get a wooden bow, the better. Uh, but in order to do that, we're going to need bow parts if we're going to make it. Or we're just going to find one. 500 meters. Here we go. Hey, there we go. Fifth stuff. visitors about the third ring of the uh, circle closing in so only one it could be only one <laughs> okay but we're getting close down to the last little bit here go in the middle uh we'll shoot oh the other direction my goodness. <laughs> oh, it could be anywhere. Oh, there it is. All right. Now let's go ahead and drink the tea. Get a little bit of hydration going. We'll have the food. And let's do this. Stamina's good. Let's get that. Oh, well, hello. I thought we got her. Hello, nurse. Uh, maybe I didn't get my arrow back. Uh, let's go ahead and get this guy before we leave. Just because we can get the XP. Got the sneak damage bonus. Which way are we heading? Northeast? Okay. Oh, it's a hell of a time for the <clears throat> bow to break. And now I've got the whole aim down sights weird thing going on. Uh, wait, did we? We did not level up, but we're close to leveling up. All right, let's switch and make the run for the border. And there's that level. Let's go ahead and put one point into archery. And let's make a better bow. The very least just helps us with a little bit more damage. All right, it's raining. So let's get back. You know, I haven't done this in a long while, but making the plant fiber hood and plant fiber shoes. Why not? Maybe a little bit of warmth. Maybe not. Who knows? But uh, make our dude look a little bit better. Oh, we need a better T-shirt though, or a hoodie. 
<laughs> hey, another. Uh, that's after three stumps. So five stumps, three stumps. At this point, I've probably stopped counting, at least out loud for the recording. Oh, what's over here? A big canyon? Ooh. I missed him. Did I hit another zombie behind him? No, I hit him. Okay. It was just off. Yeah, look at this canyon. Fun. Now I did I did create this world just immediately from random. I didn't do the less cracks, more cracks, valleys, rivers, whatever, you know, the settings that, that they give you. But uh yeah, so it, it ended up giving me that as part of the random build. I love it. You're uh, feeling under the weather. Amazing. I, I'm technically oh under the weather because I'm inside your your base here. Oh, we're definitely getting herbal antibiotics because even though we got some honey, you, you know, you know, I'm gonna get infected or something. Something's gonna happen. Um, all right, so again, there's extra medicine out there. I'll buy it off of you for a discount. Okay, so you're gonna buy it off of me for a discount. I said this before, but um, if you finish two more jobs this week, I will give you employee of the month. Like, shouldn't I be buying it for a discount? And I should be able to sell it to you for a good price? I, I don't know. Uh, all right, so let's try to knock out uh, this next one. We're going to go check these cars real quick. Aggro the zombie inside. Dang it. Uh, I love the sledgehammer, but God, it eats up your stamina, especially a iron sledge this early, but I wanted to use it. I love this about this game, that they've got these road closure areas to the tiling, everything that's set up. I, such a great improvement with Alpha 20. Some more frames. Oh. Yeah, I think she saw me. Juker, there we go. Whoop. Oh, look at her getting me back. There we go. Check the car first before we reset the POI. Oh, sun's starting to come back out. Oh, uh, we already got this stuff, so let's grab. Go check it again. Do it again. Some glue. All right, take it. Now we're encumbered, encumbered by five things. This is a clear areas quest, so we do have to kill the zombies. Oh, let's get another torch. Take that arrow back. Thank you very much. All right, let's get ready for... Oh, nice. So that is a cooking pot, not a cooking pot landmine. Cooking pot landmines now have uh, wires, obvious wires to them, circuitry. All right. Ooh. I want to get a health bar, but we got to watch our spending this early on in game. Uh, let's go ahead and clear this and then get loot. This is why we went ahead and put another point into, or a point into archery, because early levels I want to go ahead and clear out zombies as quick as possible, efficiently as possible. Now we might have a puppy dog up ahead, we got to be careful. But I do have the machine gun for backup. Wow. Got lucky there. I didn't think that lob was going to make it. Sweet. Yep, there's the dog right there. And that's what you do. Early game, you get those points put in. 
All right, so not sure what's gonna what to expect in here. Well, there we go. This guy and that guy. I heard the click. It's official. We have cleared it of all zombies. There's nothing behind there. Let's go ahead and get the loots and move on as quickly as possible. Needle and thread, uh, puffer coats. All right. So we do have a, a pistol. I don't think I'm, I don't know if I'll use it. Oh, I do want uh, pumpkin seeds right away. I love growing pumpkins in this game. I don't know why. Okay, let's go ahead and open up the door for exit. Okay, so we don't have enough room to loot the rest of the place. So here's what we're going to do. Um, let's just say two loot. Lot <laughs> to loot one, and let's go turn this in and get another quest. Okay, so far, so good. I think we'll store some more stuff in here. Okay, so that lightened up our load some more. Um, yep, there's stuff in here. Make sure that's emptied. Now, just just got to use what we got right now. We'll we'll build our specific um, storage crates later. There we go, and that needs to be repaired, which we just got rid of our stone. There we go. Okay, back over now. Seventeen hundred. We could get another job, but I don't think we'll uh, really have time to do another one. We could, maybe I could speed run one, but I don't know if I want to take that chance right now. Whoa, look! Wow, I didn't think you had it in you. Needle and thread. We already know. Spear hunter. We don't. So let's get that one. Let me see. Inventory, please. We are at sixteen hundred. So. I think we're decently on our way to a um, um, to that fifty seven hundred. I'm gonna go ahead and buy the meats. Thanks We've already got the, the eggs. We're open from dawn to dusk. Since ten percent more damage. Yeah, I'm gonna read them, but I'm not really worried about the whole um, spear. Uh, we, we did that in another game, so let's not worry about we're this game. Always looking for some adventurous. Hurry back soon. And I'll have a nice reward for you. She'll have a nice reward for me? Sweet. All right. So basically, uh, uh, let's go back and get our loot from the, uh, the diner over here. And then let's get our forge going and everything else. Now we opened up that door back here. So, yep, we can get back in. Oh, wait. We're supposed to use, like, the stone hammer on the gore block bodies aren't we ah, oh well yeah see <laughs> when we keep finding rotting flesh inside stuff no big whoop uh now i did switch over to the wrench but i'm gonna wait and harvest with the wrench later uh, i'm not gonna worry about that right now we can get more parts more uh quantity of items if we put points into salvage operations there's a, another cooking pot uh, but salvage operations is not necessarily critical right now. So if I leave cars near where we have our base, it's just less uh, distance I have to cover to go back to them. All right. That's a little plug there. Yeah, let's put on some purple shoes. Why not? <laughs> go and start getting rid of our... Uh... <laughs> Our cloth fiber uh, outfits. Oh, sounds like a zombie found his way to us. Might be a couple zombies. Yep, I hear several. Maybe a wandering horde. That's always a concern. And now I'm getting encumbered, so we're going to have to watch it. Uh, let's scrap that. Let's eat that. You know, I'll go ahead and scrap these things. Don't need that. 
don't need everything, but at least uh, you know we help a little bit by condensing. Okay, so while they're beating on that, did we not oh, check this? Okay. Not the most critical items to come back and get, but hey, why not, right? Oh, that's funny, a level two uh, primitive bow. Oh, nice. Oops. Oops, she daisy. I forgot about the whole stamina thing, as usual. Kneecap. Alright, back to base. We'll probably want to clear out that, uh, too. Eh, let's, let's do it. There we go. So that's that level we needed also uh, for anybody that didn't catch on when I was going back to get that stuff. Uh, we needed one more level to have the point to actually make the forge in the first place. So now we have the point that we need. So let's go ahead and uh, start working on that. Advanced engineering. Boom. There we go. Just clearing out some of that. Uh, let's double up. Oh, you know what? I also forgot stuff at, um, where was our first job over here? I think this one. Yes. We need to go back and get our stuff over there too. Rut row raggy. <laughs> uh, what can we leave here? There we go. Things that will combine. Ooh, we could do some Mega Crush. It'll get us over there quick, right? Right? <laughs> oh, shoot. Where was it? There's the one we need to go to. Oh, man. I completely forgot which house we went to. Was it over here? Yes, there we go. Right? Yeah, with the bird, uh, the tree house. <laughs> oh, we can't take everything. I didn't leave anything else elsewhere. Uh, let's see, stuff, and then to loot is done, so we get rid of that. Okay, empty what we can, sort it out later, empty what we can, salt it out later. That's the key one right there, is that, uh, level two pickaxe. That's, that's what reminded me, like, wait a minute, I left stuff somewhere, where is it? <laughs> oh, good golly. Uh, you know what, we could, just for the sake of claiming, we could put that down. Uh, there we go. All right, next Mega Crush. Piece of cake, right? <laughs> All right, and I don't think... Oh, yeah, I left our, the wood there. But don't think I left anything else. Yeah, that's it. Oh, oh, oh wait. Our torch. <laughs> and boom, made it back. All right, so I think we are basically going to be 
building and crafting and doing some things up top here. I did put the land claim down, so technically now that we build uh, crafting stations like a, a forge, we can pick it back up. So, um, oh, that's right, we had a filing cabinet right there. Let's put more stuff in there. Uh, we are going to need, what are the basic ingredients? Because again, like you get used to other games or you get used to this game, but as a modded version and you start forgetting what exactly are the recipes. So 60 soil, we got plenty of stone. Uh, we need leather and short iron pipe. Um, there's leather. Short iron pipes should be in one of these. There they are. Oh, clay soil. Right there. 1,200, I think we have enough. Oh, and we want to grab any uh, iron that we have. Oh, I forgot we already had some iron arrowheads. Uh, some more leather. Let's get the meats, eggs. Make some bacon and eggs during the night. For the most part during the night, I should be able to fend off stuff here. If I need to jump over here and work with zombies during the night, we will. And then we'll we'll plug up that as uh, as needed where we can. Oh, creepy music time. It's now officially nighttime. 2200 has hit. Uh, let's go ahead and plop that there. Uh, we need to put some wood in. There's our iron. Iron and clay. There we are. Um, let's wrench this stuff. Okay, campfire, grill, and we already had some cooking pots. I'll go ahead and put them all in there for now. Boom. And let's put in some of the wood. Bacon and eggs is not unlocked. Gosh darn it. <laughs> That's the next thing to work on. But at the very least, we'll put the uh, the ingredients in there for now. Uh, we can at least boil some more water. I think that will do it for tonight. Oh wait, there's pathing up here. What's, what's up here? Ooh. Hmm. Gives me thoughts, gives me ideas. We'll construct and we'll we'll work around these ideas uh, as we progress. But I think that's gonna do that do do it for day two, uh, folks. Hey, thanks for coming by for my new series. I really appreciate it. Uh, that first series already shot up to twenty views by the time I started recording this one. Uh, so I really appreciate that support. I uh, love you all very much. Uh, if you are new to my channel, however, uh, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. We're going to try to get to 500 subscribers here in the next couple months and uh, try to hit that before the end of the year. And uh, if you like my stuff, hit like. If you don't like my stuff, dislike. Yeah, either way. Uh, go ahead and share that so I can see if you are favoring or not favoring these videos. And uh, don't forget to hit that bell notification if you do want to get notified every time I post a new video. This series currently will be dropping at 1 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time, United States. And that will be every day until Alpha 21 comes out. So thanks again, everybody, for stopping on by. And as always, we'll see you on the next adventure. Bye-bye.